my guest this week is the World Wrestling Federation Champion, Macho Man, Randy Savage. Here he comes, and no one wears the World Wrestling Federation Championship any prouder than the Macho Man, Randy Savage. You can't start with that now, McMahon. We got ripped off at WrestleMania, and Ric Flair in my book is still the real World Wrestling Federation champ. Well, they just might have his opportunity to regain the title. Macho Man, I want to congratulate you, first of all, on capturing the World Wrestling Federation Championship at WrestleMania from Ric Flair. And secondly, for regaining the honor of your wife, Elizabeth, the First Lady of the World Wrestling Federation. However, there are those who say the victory was questionable because you had to bend the rules to beat Ric Flair. You gotta be ribbon. This is the 90s. You're talking about Ric Flair, a guy that'll do anything, say anything, lie about anything. Zero morals, zero credibility, a zero in life. I did what I had to do against a guy like that because he would have done the same to me. So I consider it a done deal. It's a liar, too. Get off. Macho Man, in all due respect, there are those who say that you stole the title. Stole the title? No. The only stealing going on was from you, Ric Flair. After the match, when you stole a kiss from Elizabeth, when you put your dirty, stinking, slimy, fat, disgusting lips on my wife, and you, Ric Flair, what you got and what you done did is you got the kiss of death because I'm going to get you, Ric Flair. This is the first time in WWF history where the champion is challenging the challenger. And if you think that drop in the WWF Championship was bad, uh, wait till you get dropped by me. The WWF Champion. Oh, yeah. Doesn't this guy realize that I'm going to be at ringside along with Ric Flair? Oh, I think he definitely realizes it. It's going to be a great matchup. 